What's up, Barking Family? Welcome back to my channel. Figures when I hit record, I see a truck pull up and they're about to mow the lawn. That kind of blows. So I better hurry this thing along. So today for you guys, I have a Target Dollar Spot haul. Let's pause the video here. I filmed this thing about two weeks ago and it's just getting up today. It's kind of slightly irrelevant because, um, well, Easter's just around the corner, but here you go nonetheless. High five. They had their Easter items out and I purchased quite a few of them. When I came back from my honeymoon, there was two stores I was really excited to go into. The first was Dollar Tree and the second one was Target. I'm just now getting to recording it. So let me start off with my favorite item that I bought at Target from the Target Dollar Spot section. I put it all on the ground, but that was a pillow. So this pillow, I don't know if it's from the Easter collection, but I really, really liked it. It is this decorative throw pillow. It says home on it, and then the back just has these stripes. It was $5. Throw pillow, blue pillows can get expensive sometimes. Like the Easter ones I've been looking at, I like Marshalls and TJ Maxx, which are technically places you would get inexpensive throw pillows at. They're still pretty pricey. So this, I welcome it for the $5. I think it's just really nice and chic. Doesn't scream Easter, but I was really happy to see this. Now my favorite item that I purchased from the Easter collection is this image right here. This says Carrot Patch. It was $3. I don't know if I said the throw pillow was $5. This was $3. I told you guys before, some of my favorite things to purchase from the Target Dollar Spot section are the images and I have quite a few from, like behind me. This is from like the winter collection. This is from the Valentine's Day collection. I really, really like this one. This one, I think you could transition it out of Easter, but it really does scream Easter just because carrots. So I purchased this one because I really did like it and I want to add it to my little like gallery behind me right now. I feel like you could possibly do some really cool DIYs with this if you wanted to, like add a little bit more carrots or flowers around it. You do you boo. The next items that I purchased that I absolutely love are these bunnies. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. They're only $3 each, which is a really good price. Because I got these vintage looking ones from, um, where are they from? Uh, ooh, Hobby Lobby. And I think they were half off and they were like $2.50. Not as big as this, more detailed. Not as big. So $3 for something this big is a pretty good price. They're just plain white and they could go with pretty much any type of decor that you have. I got like farmhouse decor behind me. It can go with like chic modern decor, probably bohemian decor. It's just white. It'll go with anything. So I got this one that's on his belly and it looks like it's laughing. And then this one that is just like striking a pose. Work it girl. Do your thing. I'm not keeping these bunnies here. I've got so many bunnies already behind me. I'm a little bunnied out over here. Next item I purchased is this ceramic bunny. This one was $3 as well. This one, if you wanted to paint it, it's going to take paint really nicely just because it is ceramic, which I, I don't know if I want to paint this necessarily because I feel like if I put this near a flower pot and I have some cute greenery in there, it's just going to look really nice. But if you want to paint it, you can. Actually, the little wrinkles on this bunny that look like fur, kind of creeps me out a little bit. It kind of looks like one of those like naked cats where you can really see the wrinkles on them. Hey, but he has a nice face. I like you, boo. The next item I purchased from Target is this little wreath right here. So this wreath was $3. I really do like the little wreaths that they get in the Target Dollar Spot section because I have quite a few of things like this in my house. They're just like picture frames or like mirrors in them. And I make you know, DIYs with pictures frames from Dollar Tree. And I feel like the wreaths always look really nice um, on these things from Target. And they're just like a good size. They're not too big. They're like the perfect size for all these little things that I have. This one I like a lot though because it has the willow wreath as well as greenery wrapped around it. And it really does scream spring. How cute is this? I got these salt and pepper shakers. It is a little bunny and it looks like it's holding the um, carrot right here. So this was $3, so it's $2 more than you would pay for um, like the salt and pepper shakers Dollar Tree gets in, but it is bigger than what Dollar Tree normally carries and it tends to be a little bit better quality. Um, even though I really do like the Dollar Tree shakers, except I didn't see any Easter ones this time. Anyways, like I said, it was $3, super, super cute. I wanted to get out already. I've been trying to like, Keep it in here just for the video, but now it's time to take it out, let it shine, let it pour. So I never really used carrots too much to decorate for Easter, and this time around I've really been into them. It was after I bought these carrots from right here from um, Walmart that I'm like, carrots, put them everywhere, put the carrots everywhere. So I got this pack of three carrots. Um, it's not really a pack. It was $3. I want to take the tags off of these. It doesn't look right at all. So these 
carrots, it's like fabric, like a almost like burlette fabric. And then the ones that I had gotten from Walmart, which I will show you guys right now, these ones are like look like they're made with twine. So they both are different. And I think this was three dollars as well, or two dollars and ninety-seven cents. So I mean, if you're into these type of carrots, Walmart, these ones, Target, I'm into both of them. So that's why I did. Give me both. The Target dollar spot section right now has Easter trees. They're called Easter decor trees. I bought this one. So the difference between this and the other ones that I saw, the other ones I saw had eggs on them, but I thought this one was nicer. Now this one doesn't scream necessarily Easter, it just screams spring, but Dollar Tree carries little Easter egg like ornaments. So I'm gonna hang those on this tree. I just felt like this one was nicer than the other ones because of the flowers. And then I was like, I already have the eggs and I could just attach them really nicely and get a look that I like better. So this one was $5. It has like a little wooden box that it's inside of with like moss that's covering it. And my reasoning also behind getting this tree is I could take the Easter eggs off and still be able to use this throughout the spring. Whereas the other ones, if I took the Easter eggs off of them, it's gonna really damage the tree because they were glued onto the tree. And the final item that I purchased from the Target Dollar Spot section are these decorative eggs. There's four eggs in here. There was a bunch of different eggs, but these ones are the ones that caught my eye the most. They're a pastel color. The like appearance of them almost looks like it's chalk, even though I don't think it's chalk. I really like this like pinkish, purplish egg. It's more pink, but then if you put it like in darker lighting, it kind of looks purple. It was $3. I will say that this is not the best price on decorative eggs. Dollar Tree has some really pretty ones that are dollar and there's six of them in there. And then like if you go to Michael's, they have like big bags of Easter eggs on sale that would cost you $3. So I wouldn't say like Target has the best price on these right now. So that's it for what I purchased at Target. I'm going to show you some footage right now of the other items that I saw there. They have so I went back to record the items that I saw and they were pretty wiped this time around. They have these cutting boards that were cute. They were $5. One has like bunny ears popping out and the other one looks like an egg. Then they have like these wire baskets that are dollar at Dollar Tree but they're $3 at Target so go to Dollar Tree. There was other salt and pepper shakers like this carrot one and then like a two egg one. This little like bunny planter. Honestly though you could put whatever you want inside of it. And then they have like a garden section. There was not anything too interesting there. And then there's this thing that holds eggs. And then the other tree I was talking about with the Easter eggs you can see it back there. I think all this stuff is going to be like 50% off pretty soon because Easter is just around the corner. Can you believe Easter is just around the corner? What the heck? So when I went to go film um, in the Target dollar spot, honestly, there wasn't much left over from the decor. There was a lot of like the kid stuff, but I didn't really want to share that with you guys because I don't think most of you guys are interested in like stamps and erasers and slime. So I passed on that. Complete side note, but how cute is this clock? I got it at Burlington Coat Factory. It's not even called that anymore. It's just called Burlington for $7.99. And it's a pretty decent sized clock. And I couldn't pass it up. So that's it for this Target Dollar Spot Hall or Bullseye, whatever you call it, Bullseye Playground, whatever. I just call it Target Dollar Spot. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and make sure you check out Target. Let me know which item that I showed you guys you would like to get your hands on. I hope they get more in. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. Take care. Bye.